Everyone, no matter how skilled at prompting you are, even if you're a bloody prompt engineer, will at some point struggle with prompting, where they ask ChatGPT or whatever AI they use to do something and it's just not getting it. So you have to prompt again and again, maybe even re-explain yourself or give more context or just start from scratch completely and start a brand new chat. It's very frustrating when you ask these AIs what to do and they just don't get it and the result isn't near or at all what you want. Well, luckily enough and quite paradoxically, I have one prompt to give you. I know, but it's just one prompt to give you to use that will fix all these other prompting problems. So instead of being fed all these prompt packs that you must buy so you get the most optimal output and people selling these stupid prompt packs. If I sell a prompt pack, I want you to wring my neck. No one wants your f***ing prompt pack. Well, some people do because they're buying it. Anyway, this one prompt has been talked about a good bit on social media. And what I'm about to give you is a prompt optimizer prompt. So you use this to fix your prompts and make them work the first time. So anytime I know I have a big task to ask and I want it to just give me the best output it can the first time around, instead of recycling feedback and more context and trying again, then I put it in this prompt. It spits out a much better prompt I can use. And then I plug that in and it works amazing and the results are way better. And I also use it if I'm just feeling a bit lazy of thinking through how to write the most optimal prompt in this situation. So sometimes in those cases, I'll just go ahead and throw it in this prompt and it'll spit out what I need. In fact, I even used it on my AI mentorship blueprint and spit out amazing prompts for each step so you can build it better and get a better result with your AI mentor. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, just check out the link in the description. So what is this magical prompt that'll fix all your prompt problems? Well, for some reason, it's called Lyra. That's right, Lyra, L-Y-R-A. I have no idea why it's called that, but it is. So where did this prompt come from? Well, basically this ex-user named Min Choi, credit to him, found this prompt on Reddit. So if you go to X and you go to Min Choi, find this guy and then search up Lyra, you can find this prompt and pretty hefty prompt. As you can see, a lot of views, 343,000. And most people might think, okay, so Min Choi created it and it's a $500 an hour consultant. Well, hold your horses because if we scroll down a bit, we see, ah, Reddit source. So this is where he got it from. And basically, in fact, I'll just read this to you because it's pretty funny. <laughs> it's, it's a Reddit user who just snapped. So last Tuesday, he was on his 147th attempt to get ChatGPT to write a simple email that didn't sound like a robot. And he was having an existential crisis, snapped, and then decided to spend the next 72 hours building what he calls or she calls Lyra. And it's some meta prompt that makes ChatGPT make any prompt much, much better. And he explains kind of how to use it and the results. And then boom, he gave away the whole prompt. And this is it. Like I said, pretty hefty indeed. So you can read this for yourself in Reddit in r slash ChatGPT. And yeah, he claims we broke Reddit. Sorry, not sorry. Indeed he did. It's quite a useful prompt, hence the video. Anyway, okay, so now I'll show you an example using Lyra. And if you want, you can just paste this whole prompt right into its own chat if you don't want to use a project or can't, and it'll work just fine. In this case, I'm just going to use the project. And if you have access to projects, just make it a project. So I'll just copy and paste the prompt from there, paste it in here. I'll show you how this works. So it's going to activate and say something like, hi, I'm Lyra, this, that. So there it is. Now I'm going to think of a prompt I want improved. So let's say, okay, I know. So give it this context here. You can just straight up ask it to improve a prompt immediately. And even if you do that, I suggest you give some context beforehand from your other chat. Be like, here's the context. And then here's the prompt for you to improve based on that. And boom, it'll be quick. But if you really want to make sure that first prompt is outstanding, then just go ahead and go through the usual process alongside this. It really is like a $500 an hour consultant. And some of you clever people might be thinking, interesting, so it's a prompt optimizer and you use this giant prompt to make better prompts, but what if I took the Lyra prompt and asked itself to improve it and created a Lyra version two? Well, I did that. So I took the time to create a version two model of it and just improved on it based on Lyra itself. And don't worry, I'm gonna copy and paste the whole Lyra version two 
prompt in the description below or the comments or both. And I double checked to make sure that the second version of Lyra made using the original Lyra, hope you're keeping up with me, is better. And it is. Here's why. It provides clearer, more precise instructions, reduces ambiguity, and ensures consistent high quality prompts. It has more detailed explanations, better structured frameworks, and a professional tone that helps users understand each step of the process better. So basically, it's just an amped up version of the original Lyra prompt, making it easier to deliver accurate and effective AI prompts reliably. So using chat GPT, want detailed prompt, and let's throw in the model using model 4.5 and then optimize this prompt. Write an amazing marketing email to my email list. Thanks for all of you who have subscribed, by the way. I appreciate you. And I just appreciate anyone watching too. Anyway, write an amazing marketing email to my email list about my new AI mentorship course launching in one month, which is coming by the way. Month, hopefully, we'll see. So there's a simple prompt and it might ask more questions or it'll just get right to it. We'll see in this case. Okay, so it's gonna ask a bit more to maximize the effectiveness and precision of the prompt. So could you briefly describe your target audience? Da, 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 da. So it's actually already getting all of that right, apparently. So it must be pulling from the memory in ChatGPT. So I'm just gonna paste what it wrote there in the examples. So, oh, hello, that's weird. Entrepreneurs too. And these are just some of the things, obviously. Not everything. I'll tell you about that another time. Now as the context, so now it should improve the prompt. And there we go. Now it is spitting out this insanely detailed prompt, which is quite phenomenal indeed. I mean, look at this thing. It's still going, which is nuts. And just think of the time it would take you to go through the hassle of asking that thing and then giving it more context and then trying again and then restarting and all that struggle and frustration that can come from prompting. And instead, you could just go through this. And it's even giving us structure like this. <laughs> this is quite good. Okay, so now it's done. Now we're going to copy that giant prompt. Usually, you would have already started a chat, or this would be mid chat or something, but you can just start it from scratch if you want. So I'm going to go new chat and paste the optimized prompt. Voila, send, and let's see what we get. And there's the email. So let's give it a read. Two subject lines. I read through it, gave me a very good email, honestly. This is quite good. I would make it a little less business marketing-esque and more personal marketing, but quite good. And that's the result. So there you have it. I guess I'll call it Lyra V2, and that'll be in the description or comments or both below. And you will also see two links above that. One is just three free 30 short daily reads of better ways to use ChatGPT and insights. And then the other is my AI mentor mode blueprint that I mentioned at the beginning of the video. So those will be there, both free, obviously. And if you want a video walkthrough on setting up your AI mentor mode using that blueprint, then watch this video here. I hope this prompt helps save you from a lot of future frustration with prompting and gives you much better results. Okay, thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.